Hello, my name is Michael. I'm a junior physics major at SUNY Geneseo, and I'm interning here at the most. Today, I wanted to talk to you about coral reefs. Here's a question. Are coral plant or animal? They're actually an animal. When coral starts out, they start as very tiny creatures known as polyps, and they gather on rock formations, and they just keep piling and piling up. And eventually, you get what you see here, all these corals. Now here at the most, we have a few species of coral, and you can see the different ones, and they have bright, uh, vast colors. And that is because they have plankton that live on them. And the plankton form a, what is known as a symbiotic relationship with the coral, where the coral will help the plankton thrive and the plankton help the coral thrive. And if you see here, this is the blue tang. Uh, you may have recognized this fish. This is the same fish species that Dory is in the classic kids' movies Finding Nemo and Finding Dory. And what we wanted to talk today about was coral reef bleaching. You may have read an article a while back that said that the Great Barrier Reef is dead. However, that is not true. It is dying, however. And what we mean by that is that with the rising temperature in oceans, the coral is becoming very stressed and it is becoming bleached white. The plankton is dying off, and that's very unhealthy for the local fish. And you can learn this and much more about reefs at the most in Syracuse. Make sure you come on down and check it out.